Welcome back to Electricity Frenzy, the channel where we dive deep into all things electrical. Today, we're going to explore a common issue that many of us have faced, a dishwasher tripping the circuit breaker. We'll discuss the potential causes, how to diagnose each one, and the possible solutions. So, let's get started. If your dishwasher tripping the breaker it's not necessary means the dishwasher is faulty, there are many other potential causes. As I will discuss with you in this video. First, let's look at the potential causes for your dishwasher tripping the circuit breaker. 1. Overloaded circuit. Dishwashers typically draw a significant amount of power when they are in operation. If the dishwasher is connected to a circuit that already has a heavy load, such as other appliances or devices, it may exceed the circuit's capacity and trip the breaker. Diagnosis. Check if the dishwasher is connected to a circuit with other appliances. Try to connect the dishwasher on another circuit and see if it will trip the breaker. Measure the load on the circuit using an ammeter or consult an electrician to determine if it exceeds the circuit's capacity. Solution. Redistribute the load by moving some appliances to different circuits. Alternatively, install a dedicated circuit for the dishwasher to ensure it has sufficient capacity. 2. Inadequate circuit capacity. If the dishwasher is on a dedicated circuit and still tripping the breaker, it suggests that the dishwasher's power requirements exceed the capacity of the breaker. Diagnosis. Confirm that the dishwasher is indeed on a dedicated circuit. Determine the power requirements of the dishwasher and compare them to the rating of the circuit breaker. Solution. Upgrade the circuit or electrical panel to accommodate the dishwasher's power needs. This may involve increasing the breaker's amperage rating or installing a new circuit with a higher capacity. 3. Faulty circuit breaker. A faulty circuit breaker itself can cause frequent trips. Over time, breakers can become worn out, weakened, or damaged, leading to false trips. Diagnosis. If the breaker trips frequently and other causes have been ruled out, it may indicate a faulty circuit breaker. Consult an electrician to inspect and test the breaker for proper functioning. Solution. Replace the faulty circuit breaker with a new one that matches the specifications of the electrical system. This should be done by a licensed electrician for safety and compliance. 4. Faulty wiring. Frayed or damaged wiring can cause a short circuit, leading to a breaker trip. Over time, wires can become frayed or loose, increasing the risk of electrical faults. The breaker trips to protect your devices and home from the excessive current and fire hazard. Diagnosis. A professional electrician should inspect the dishwasher's wiring and the circuit for any signs of damage, loose connections, or improper installation. Solution. Repair or replace any damaged wiring, ensuring proper insulation and secure connections. It's crucial to have a qualified electrician perform the necessary repairs for safety reasons. 5. Defective dishwasher components. A malfunctioning dishwasher component, such as a motor, heating element, or control board, can cause an electrical overload or short circuit, leading to a breaker trip. Diagnosis. If you notice any unusual noises, burning smells, or other signs of a faulty component, it's best to contact a technician or the dishwasher's manufacturer for repair or replacement. Solution. Repair or replace the defective dishwasher component as recommended by the technician or manufacturer. Only authorized professionals should handle appliance repairs for safety and warranty compliance. 6. Ground fault or short circuit. A ground fault occurs when an exposed wire comes into contact with a conductive surface, such as the metal frame of the dishwasher. Similarly, a short circuit happens when the live wire and neutral wire come into direct contact. Both situations can cause a breaker trip. Diagnosis. An electrician should perform a thorough inspection to identify any ground faults or short circuits. This may involve testing the wiring and conducting a visual examination of the dishwasher's electrical components. Solution. Correct any ground faults or short circuits by repairing or replacing the affected wiring or components. It's essential to have a professional electrician perform these repairs to ensure safety and proper electrical function. 7. Low voltage or voltage drop. Insufficient voltage supply or voltage drop in the electrical system can cause the dishwasher's motor to draw more current, potentially exceeding the breaker's capacity and leading to a trip. Diagnosis. An electrician should assess the voltage levels in the electrical system to identify if low voltage or voltage drop is occurring. This may involve voltage measurements at various points in the circuit during dishwasher operation. Solution. 
Address low voltage or voltage drop issues by identifying and resolving any underlying electrical system problems. This may include repairing faulty connections, upgrading electrical panels, or consulting with the utility company to ensure adequate voltage supply. Remember, for electrical issues, it's always recommended to consult with a qualified electrician who can diagnose the problem accurately and provide appropriate solutions based on your specific circumstances. That's all for today's episode of Electricity Frenzy. I hope you found this information helpful. If you have any questions or suggestions for future topics, please let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more electrifying content. Until next time, stay safe and keep exploring the world of electricity.